All right, so this is going to be a short video on how to run uh, the new Vicuna model. Um, and for this tutorial, we're going to be using llama.cpp. It's kind of like the last tutorial where we used alpaca.cpp, but this is a more up-to-date version. So uh, the first thing that you want to do is click the first link, and it will download the Vicuna model. Um, it's about 8 gigabytes in size. And then uh, while you're downloading that, um, head over to the second link uh, and it'll take you to the releases page and then you'll just want to download um, the llama uh, repository so um, download that zip file unpack it and then you'll have a folder that looks something like this um, except you won't have this file or this file this is the model that you just downloaded so put it in the same folder as the rest of the files that you just unzipped and then after that uh, head down to the description one last time and then make a new text document name it run.bat and then take out the text um, click yes yeah, well i already have one so but after you make a bat file oh also you might have to uh, enable file name extensions to do that so then edit the bat file and then uh, paste in uh, what is in the description it'll look a little bit different than this because i have some other stuff but um, paste in uh, exactly what i have in the description and then you can run the bat file and it will look something like this and if if you see all this then that means it's working if it's just loading tensors for some reason, it seems like this model doesn't actually use that much memory. It only seems to use about four gigabytes for me. Um, and it doesn't use, it uses about the same CPU as the other models use. So, um, but yeah, this is the 13 billion parameter model of uh, Vicuna. And it seems to work just fine with four gigabytes of memory somehow. But um, that's pretty much it. If you have any problems, join the Discord and uh, I'll be able to help you out there. And thanks for watching.